Fire blight is a bacterial issue that affects trees and the rose family. This means we end up seeing fire blight in a lot of our pear and apple trees in Wyoming. Fire blight is most common during wet springs with warm weather. To look for signs of fire blight, we can look for water-soaked blossoms, changes in leaf color, or once things have progressed, we end up with shepherd hooks. The common question is, how do I take care of it? There are several options, but they can sometimes be challenging. Probably the most common way to deal with fire blight is pruning. When pruning for fire blight, it's important to sterilize pruning equipment. You can use a bucket of water with a bleach solution, so that way you're not spreading that bacteria from one branch to another. Once you have the branches that have been pruned on a fire blight tree, you need to properly dispose of them. You don't want to leave those around so that they can continue to contaminate other parts of that tree later on. Antibacterial sprays can also be used to combat fire blight, although their effectiveness can sometimes be hit or miss. There is a chance for building up resistance and it needs to be applied early on in the season so we hopefully are not building up that resistance for the bacteria. When selecting new trees, you can also think about selecting disease resistant varieties. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Brian Sebade and you're watching From the Ground Up.